This tutorial video assumes the following. Your PT-878 has been programmed correctly for recording log files. You have saved log files on your PT-878. Your PT-878 is powered up and you are connected to your computer through the wireless infrared port on the PT-878. Press the menu button on the keypad. This will bring up the main menu at the top of the display screen. Use the right arrow key on the keypad to navigate over to the Logging tab. With the Logging tab highlighted, press the Enter button on the keypad. A new drop-down menu will appear with two options, Log Manager and New Log. Press the Enter button on the keypad. This will open the Log Manager on the display screen. You will see a list of saved logs on the left side of the display screen. Use the up and down arrows on the keypad to highlight any log you would like to transfer. With a selected log highlighted, press the menu button on the keypad. This will move your cursor to the menu on the top of the display screen and the file tab will be highlighted. Press the down arrow key on the keypad. This will open a drop down menu. Use the down arrow key to navigate to the bottom of the menu and highlight the transfer option. Press the enter button on the keypad which will transfer the log file to the desktop of your computer. A message window will pop up on your computer screen. Click on the yes to all option. This will transfer the log file to your computer. When the file transfer is completed, click on the Close Window option on your desktop. You could locate the transferred log on the main desktop of your computer. In order to read the log file, you will need to convert it to an XLS file using the Panalog Viewer software that came with your PT-878 kit. After you have installed your Panalog Viewer software, double-click the Panalog Viewer icon on your desktop. This opens the Panalog Viewer software. Click on the file selection at the top of the window. That will open a drop-down menu, then click on the open option. This brings up a navigation window. When the PT-878 saves a log to your computer, it saves it on the desktop, so make sure you have the desktop location highlighted. Look on the right-hand side of the window and you should see the log file you saved in the list of items. For this example, we transferred a file called log01.log. Select the log file by clicking on the file and then click on the open button at the bottom right of the window. You should now see information in the Panalog Viewer window, including the start and stop times, intervals, and records. On the right side of the Panalog Viewer window, you will see a button labeled Export. Before you press the Export button, make sure that you have the XLS format chosen. If you see that the CSV format is chosen, click on the drop-down triangle and choose Excel.XLS format. Press the Export button and an Export Saving window appears. You can change the name of the log and the location of where you want to store it on your computer. For this purpose, we will just save it with the same name back to the desktop. Press the Save button and the log will be converted into the Excel XLS format and Excel will open the file automatically when the log conversion is complete. After the log file is converted into the Excel file, you can see from this specific recorded log information such as the date, time, and volume with gallons per minute. Depending on what you program the log file to record on the PT-878 is what you will see in the converted log.